Superman becomes Bizarro and whole Metropolis 2. In a topsy-turvy turn of events thanks to Bizarro's funky magic, Metropolis has become a city of goofballs, with everyone acting all backward. When a sad sack teen tries to take a dive off a building, instead of talking him down, the Bizarro folks egg him on like it's a diving competition. Meanwhile, pilots kick back in their seats while passengers try to steer the plane, talk about a bumpy ride. Even the firefighters are on a mission to spread flames rather than dousing them. It's a madhouse. And poor Superman, the beacon of hope, has become Bizarro number one, leading the chaos parade. He's under Bizarro's spell, and the only one who can snap him out of it is himself, easier said than done. But when he finally breaks free, his Bizarro sweetheart Lois is not impressed. She wanted a Bizarro hubby, not the original recipe. So, Soups has to bid her adieu, promising to come back once he sorts things out. Now, our caped crusader has his work cut out for him. The city's in shambles, and everybody's chanting for Bizarro number one's return like he's the hero of the century. But Soups isn't about to let that happen. Even with Bizarro number one still rattling around in his noggin, making snarky comments like a backseat driver, he's determined to save the day. But it's not all sunshine and rainbows. Days pass, and Metropolis is on lockdown. The big shots of Earth want to lend a hand, but Superman's like, nope, stay put, or you might catch the Bizarro bug. Poor Dr. Fate even gets turned into a Bizarro and boxed up by Zatanna and Madame Xanadu. Batman's like, bro, come on, fall back. But Soups ain't leaving his city to fend for itself. Meanwhile, Bizarro Lois is leading a bonfire of anti-Bizarro books under Superman's statue. And every time Soups tries to swoop in and save the day, he gets a face full of Bizarro laser beams. Talk about a rude awakening. But he keeps his cool, even as Bizarro number one tries to tempt him back into the wacky world of Bizarro's. As days drag on and the quarantine fails miserably, the bizarro madness spreads worldwide. Superman's left feeling like the lone sane ranger in a world gone bananas. And he figures there's only one way to fix things, he's gotta duke it out with bizarro in his own noggin. But to do that, he needs a wingman, or should I say, a joker in the deck. Yep, he's turning to the one guy who's got a few screws loose himself, bizarro joker. This is gonna be one wild showdown.